Hi guys, so I've been doing a makeup story tag and I was tagged by Finnish Lipsticks a while ago and also I've been asked by Beauty Bangle as well to do this tag so I'll leave both their links in the description box. Please go and get checked into the to the channel please and go and subscribe to them because they really do good, really good videos. So yeah, so I'm not going to be tagging anyone specifically to do this tag so if you would like to do this video please feel free to leave it as a response if you'd like to. So yeah, so I'm going to get on to those questions now. Question one, how old were you when you started wearing makeup? Um, I was about 12 when I first started going to high school. Question two, how did you get into makeup? Basically from a young age because I was just looking at my mum the way she was doing her makeup. It just really inspired me so much uh, from my mum. And there are times that she would like let me use her lipstick or something or like, just before we go out she would put like, a bit of lipstick on for me or something. And then um, and then just gradually I started like collecting a little bit of makeup and like you know a bit of like nail, like nail varnish and stuff like trying that out or no nail varnish yeah that as well as like you know normal makeup so there were times that like when when the whole magazines were all coming out in shops like Shout Magazine and Just 17 or something like that I remember getting those sort of magazines and they they always had that sort of thing that they always have a free makeup in magazines so it's like one of those like palettes of a gloss or like an eyeshadow or from mascara or like a blush or something so I would collect those and I have that in my little box um, I still got that box somewhere I think I don't know if the whole all makeup still in there but anyway yeah and just from gradually just from magazines and as well as like when I used to go when I was in the brownies um, there's always been a lot of discos, so I always wore just a bit of makeup because you can never, you can't never. I mean, like when you go to disco, you can't really say no to wear a little bit of makeup. So I, I put a bit of makeup then, um, just just a little bit, not too much, and um, just a little bit of like a gloss and a bit of mascara or something, or just a tiny bit of an eyeshadow or something like that. And then gradually, I just I start collecting like from the magazines and stuff. And it inspired like from my mum at, at first when I was a lot younger, then from her friends, and then just like from looking at magazines. And I just like when I look at the magazines when I was a lot younger, I was like thinking, oh, I'm gonna be just like that, like to wear makeup and stuff. So that's how basically you just got. That's how I got into makeup basically. And also when I, okay, when I when I said like the whole collective box thing of makeup, I when I was a lot younger back then, I used to like experiment. Um, you know, used those sort of makeup with friends and like doing makeovers when I was a lot, lot younger and and yeah, just like you know, just, just like that basically. So that's how I got into makeup basically. Three, what are some of your favorite brands? Mac, Elf, Benefit. Even though I don't have a lot in Benefit, but I really do like Benefit. Um, Sleek, Barry M, Maybelline. Number five, if you could only wear four products on your face, what would they be? Definitely concealer a powder, mascara and lip gloss. Number six, what's your favourite thing about makeup? Just experimenting with different looks and like being really creative. Number seven, um, what do you think about drugstore makeup via high end makeup? Well I use both um, high end makeup and drugstore makeup but I just do think there's a difference sometimes um, drugstore is a lot good as a high end but it's, it just depends on a person's budget to be honest. Just one tip of advice you'll give for a be beginner: just don't over, just don't overdo it. Like, just start with like one item at a time. Like, if it's like to be lipstick or a blush or a mascara, just anything like that, and then just gradually you can just just start build, building it all up, and you know, just by using other different products to your face. So yeah. Um, number nine. What's one makeup trend that you never understood? Um. Probably just like how people just draw on their eyebrows. I mean, I know you just just do like that, but like like some people just like really overdo it and just make it like a very big thing. I don't really understand that to be honest. Ten. What do you think about the beauty community on YouTube? I just think YouTube is just amazing because like, you can come across to um, different ranges of videos of what people do in their videos and you can get to know them a lot better in their videos like you can see f from their personality and how down to earth they really are and just like I just like really really like watching like like reviews and stuff and like 
um, just things like you see in a horse that you don't come across that you want to buy something and then you just like when you see someone's call or a review that you just want to go out there and get it so that's what that's how I am like basically and I just love everything about YouTube to be honest because you just meet like really nice people on here and you see how they are like and they're like really supportive and everything that I came across to so yeah I just love everything about YouTube basically and I think it's this YouTube is amazing website ever so yeah um is that that's all I can really say so I hope you like this video and I'll see you guys in the next video I do bye guys